how has it been learning to like really play off the ball? Cause I would assume your whole career, especially when you were with us was just, you were the primary, you were the ball handler. You did everything. You handled the press, you ran the off, everything kind of ran through you in that sense. Like, do you like playing off the ball more? Do you like the balance? Like what's been the hardest part about playing without the ball in your hands? Like you're used to. Yeah. I think, um, I think like the way the NBA game is, it's so, it's so positionless. And so like, if you could pass dribble, shoot, you could really just fit in and guard multiple, like guard multiple positions. I think that's been the biggest thing for me to get on the court is I've been able to be versatile on that side of the floor. And I think, um, I've been learning to kind of learning how to kind of find my, find my way off the ball. Um, and I think I've, I've gotten opportunities in my past more than you think, probably just like playing with Jalen. He was the point kind of a little bit mm-hmm. sometimes I'll play the two. And like, even when I used to play at Montverde, like RJ would kind of bring it up sometimes I'll play the two. So, I've gotten I've gotten times where in the past where I've gotten to play the two and learned a little bit, but I think um, it's been an adjustment period. And I think I've been doing a solid job just understanding where to take my like where to pick my spots.